adding a fitting to a pipe. To add a fitting in the Pipe Flow Expert, we can either use the Add Fittings button on the toolbar or the Add and Change Fittings button in the pipe play. To add a fitting using the Add Fittings Toolbar button, click this button. Notice now that the fitting symbol is displayed next to your cursor. Click on the pipe you want to add the fitting in the drawing plane. This will open the pipe fitting friction coefficients window with a list of available fittings that come as standard. The required fitting size is displayed as default based on the nominal metric or imperial pipe size. Because the section is T-shaped, we are going to be looking at the branch T and the through T fittings. Double click on the fitting item to add it to the pipe. All the fittings and their K values on the selected pipe are displayed in the fittings on table where we can select the quantity and also if we want the fitting to be either at the start or at the end of the pipe. Click save to add the fitting to the pipe. Alternatively, you can add a fitting by clicking the add and change fittings button in the pipe plane. Once a pipe has been selected, its information is displayed here. This includes the number of fittings shown next to the button. Clicking here will open up the database of fittings to choose from. This time, we'll choose the through T. When one or more fittings are added to the pipe, the include checkbox is displayed next to the add and change fittings button. And checking the include box will exclude all the fittings data from pipe flow experts calculations. Notice that the fitting is now greyed out in the diagram. Download your free trial of pipe flow expert today at www.pipeflow.com.